prescription pills Greg has? He's got a bit of a shoulder thing. Maybe we can grind something up and put it in our butts in their kitchen. <laughs> Do you want to go into their son's room and pretend that we're grieving parents and make love on the child's bed? <laughs> we could openly weep and then fuck. <laughs> Yeah, I mean, I gotta find someone to fuck in there, but you know, right now he's like jerking off in corners. Like, yeah. I mean, their kid's too young for me to like put porn in there, and it's like, it, what, what, by the time he fucking learns what a hard on is, it's gonna be like super porn out there where it just flows like water. So, you know, there's, there's nothing I can do for him. He's already gone. His little soul is damned already. So I was like, all right, let me. Fucking eat their ice cream and watch their Netflix, but I could be fucking something in there. Besides their laundry. That's going to. <laughs> you know that's getting down. Uh, but one thing I wanted to do um, and think about was like, alright, any of you guys married here? If you just know? Yeah? Okay. Uh, well, I was like thinking about a way to like propose to a woman that I would like, you know, be in love with supposedly, or she was rich or something, or that she would be black so I could prove that I'm not a bad person. <laughs> It's Matt and his black wife. Come on. Take that, Dad. He's like, I'm totally understanding about this. Fuck you, Dad. Me and black wife are running around. What's your name? I don't know yet. He's trying to find her a black wife name. She says she's Jennifer, but I'm not Biden. So, I'm so not racist. Black wife. And so, uh, I wanted to propose to a woman. Um, when we are fucking, <laughs> or as the poets say, porking, you know, <laughs> throwing it in her. Would that, is that, is that stupid crazy? Is that like the dumbest idea that any of you ladies have ever heard? Like you and I, we don't, you, you and any one of these other guys in the front row are fucking and then they, they like stop everything like, hey, will you marry me? Yeah, you probably think we were lying because we were, but this one time it could be for real. And so I tried it out once and she was like, yes, yes. Oh God, yes. Uh, you still gotta pay, but like, okay. <laughs> I mean, that's marriage, right guys? <laughs> no? No? All right then, yes. <laughs> Got a yes out of it. Fucking sweet. So then feminism happens, and now making love to me is like a wrestling match for the bottom. We're just trying to get some fucking leverage. It's like, it, you know, I don't know what it is or what it is about women but that things they think that they are so beautiful when they're prone. You know. <laughs> Just take me now. You look comfortable, all right? No pussies are getting wet when I've got my sweatpants on. <laughs> and in the front there. <laughs> all I'm saying is, girls, just, just just get on top once in a while. Because, like, yeah, you look really relaxed, but you also look dead. Like, I'm on top of you. What's happening? I'm getting mixed signals here. And then I come, so. <laughs> the end. Thank you. <laughs> it ever again, huh? Because I was just like, hey, I want to fuck your stuff. <laughs> but no one here thought that was funny. Everybody was like, eh, let Matt. He's nice. He's not going to fuck anybody on there. You alright? Oh yeah, fine. I actually did fuck somebody there, but I thought I'd be <laughs> No, it's funny when you get to fuck him, dude. <laughs> Everybody wins. He won. The what? He won. Thank you. Yeah. You win. Winner. Winner, winner. What were we competing against? <laughs> Getting laid. Getting laid? It's a competition. It is. You always win. I bet you come first every time. Every time. You're the winner. Did it again. All right. <laughs> you lost. <laughs> <laughs>